Once again, welcome back to Someday You'll Return, this time for part five, and this is where we start chapter four. And we do that by following Stella's diary and looking for this place. And this place I know quite well. I've actually passed it twice, I suppose. So let's visit it a third time and let's see what we find there. Uh, the woman's gone. I don't know exactly where she's gone, but she's got her own little mission, her own little quest, I think. I'd still like to know a little bit more about her. Still don't know her name. Um, yeah, let's leave the camp behind. Probably don't need that, but yeah, let's go back this way, following the yellow trail, over the bridge, and back towards the church. I got a message. I got a message. Oh, okay. Eleonora. Oh, and I've added my number to your phone. I hope you don't mind. E. Wait, is that her name? Oh, yeah, I think so. Uh, <laughs> nice name, smiley face. And that's it. Okay. Eleonora. Oh. Well, there you go. Now I know her name. Fantastic. Anyway, yeah, let's go back this way. And see this. Was this here before? I don't remember seeing it, but I suppose I was approaching it from the wrong angle, so... Wait, is there another one over there as well? Oh shit, there is. Okay, I'm feeling kind of blind. I don't remember seeing this. Maybe it wasn't here. Maybe this is new. Maybe this is since the fire. Anyway, yeah, this way. So, I remember going over there, having a good overview of the camp. That's right. We go this way. Nothing there. Again, yeah, J-N-G-K. I... Really, I'm feeling very blind now. This is where we met Eleonora. She's not here anymore, of course. Um, yeah. So, back towards the bridge. Oh, hang on. Oh, there she is. Daniel? Hi, Eleonora. What's up? I've been looking around, and there are some things that just don't make sense. Tell me about like it. what? Like, exactly how long has Stella been missing? Only a couple of hours. Or maybe it's been days. Or it's longer. Hard to tell. Okay. And when was the last time you talked to her? She called me here in the forest, but our call got cut off. That's why I went to the camp. Hmm. That doesn't seem possible. Hmm. What? You don't believe me? Calm down. I'm just checking some facts. Anyway, talk to you later. Okay, you check some facts. I'll check some paths away from the trail, because I don't actually think I went this way before. So... I'm wondering if there's going to be a lurk in it for me, honestly. I really do like what they've done with the forest in this game. Sleeping bag down there. Okay, nothing else to find. Okay, we got another diagram, another drawing. Okay. Wait, is that the is that the campfire? The one there? Is there anything around it apart from bottles? No. Well, I mean there's salicide mushrooms, but Okay, I can go down. What's with, what's with this arrow? You can go around this? Maybe you can. Oh, oh, it's working. Oh. Oh! Oh, look at this! Oh, I didn't see this last time! Okay, there's a box down here. What's in the box? Okay, uh, that I do not want. But this I do. It's the Legend of Vanadier trick. Okay. Um, hey, Don. I don't have any with me, but here's an idea to get a bit of an adrenaline rush. You know that kids camp down there? They have pretty hefty supplies of everything. I checked there when nobody was in and found that they leave pretty much everything wide open. Uh, nothing a devious mind and a wire cutter couldn't handle. So, what do you say? Should we have some fun and restock? Anyway, here's a new weird tale for you. Not far from Varnsdorf, there lived a pious and honourable knight known as Banadirtrick. He was such a man of faith that an angel brought him food and the wind carried his coat. The devil tried for many years to seduce Banadirtrick to sin, but he couldn't succeed. Then one day, he finally found a way. During a Sunday mass, the devil, dressed as an old hunchback man, chewed on a goat skin while pounding his head against the church gate. Banadirtrick started to laugh in church. Since that day, no angel brings him food, and no wind carries his coat. The knight then sinned in every possible way, and even hunted on sacred feast days. Suddenly, a voice from the sky roared, Banadirtrick, 
How long will you hunt? The knight replied, As long as God allows me. The answer came promptly, So you will hunt until the judgment day. From that day, people say you can see an apparition of a wild hunter, followed by the barking of his hunting pack roaming the woods. Wonderful. That's just wonderful. That's it? That appears to be it. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely it. And that is a long way down. Holy shit. Okay, yeah. Uh, well, that was cool. Yeah, that was really nice, actually. Maybe I should be paying more attention to those drawings. Anyway, I don't want the mushrooms. At least, not yet. Uh, yeah, let's get down. This should take me back down to where the, the bridge is. And I do want to go across the bridge after all, don't I? That's it, over here. Yeah, okay, so that was just hidden away. Neat. Right. So, ah, uh, okay. I've still got a calm enough mind to cross the bridge, so that's good. That's good. Anyway, we're not too far away from the church or the totem pole looking thing. In fact, there it is. And I think that is... That is the one that was drawn in the book. You just got the fire going. Oh? That's not stellar, is it? What we got here? Hey! Leave my things alone! What the hell is she doing here? Careful! You don't want to slip. You really don't. Uh, that castle is pretty far away. I bet you can't throw it all the way there. <laughs> Let me try. Why no. I'm looking for someone. Um, is she lost? Oh yeah. Wait. How do you know? I've seen you together. Oh, I see. Uh, not Ellie. No, she's fine. I'm looking for my daughter. What does your daughter look like? Uh, hell if I know. I've been here for so long, and with my head injury, I I feel like I'm forgetting everything. Mm. Does she look like me? <laughs> no, no. Stella's a, a lot older than you. That's a pretty name. I hope the beast didn't get her. What did you just say? <laughs> There's a mean beast in this forest. Last time, he almost caught me in the castle over there. But I left my doll there. Listen, girl. This forest isn't safe for you. You should run home at once. Would you bring my doll back for me? I told you to go. Her name is Rosie. If you do, I'll show you where the beast lives. Oh. Maybe you can find Stella there. Please. I think I know where the beast lives, to be honest. But how could you possibly know that? I've been there lots of times. Oh. There are way too many strange things about this girl. Still, she might be my only connection to Stella. The journal did bring me here, after all. It Guess did. Guess I'll play along for now to find out more. You know what? Let's go together, and you can show me where you lost your doll. Hmm. I'll help you get her back. No. No? I'm too scared to go back. Okay. I'll check the castle alone. Where did you leave your doll? The castle's closed, but I have a secret way to get inside. Go, go on. Go this way until you find the red and blue marks. When you reach okay. the crossing, follow the blue color. Next the blue to the trail. dogs... Ugh, this the is dogs. too hard. Bring me my pencil and paper. I'll draw it for you. Pencil and paper. Pencil and paper. Okay, she's gonna draw me a map. Oh, okay, well, there we go. Chapter 5. Leah. Uh, ah, look at that. Okay, so we've got some, got some pencils. And we got some paper as well. Let's have a look at that. What's she been drawing? That's the castle, isn't it? Right. With the beast lurking in the tower. A little bit alarming. Okay. <laughs> uh, sure. Okay, well, I, I'll just give these to you. Thank you. I'll draw you the way. Thank you very much. Follow my map, but watch out. The way there is kind of tricky. Oh, yeah? Sometimes even I get mixed up. When you reach the end... Look for a secret tunnel. I always go through it to enter the castle. Do you go there often? No, not anymore. I'm scared of the beast. Hmm. And, and where exactly should I look for your doll? In the castle. The castle was very high back then. All right, all done. What? I just fucking throw it away. What if the wind took that away? Oh. <laughs> what? My name. 
What's yours? Oh, um, I I'm Daniel. Please wait for me here, Leah. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere else. Yeah, she's gonna go anywhere else. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if she slips. Or she's just another figment of my imagination. Anyway, right. Let's have a look at this, shall we? Thanks. Not here. Nice. I think I was hearing this during the cutscene as well. Okay, so let's just take a quick look, shall we? Uh, no, let's go. To, let's go to the notebook this time. So, yeah, Leah's map. That's right. Yeah. My big map to castle. So, yeah. We just need to follow the blue. We get to the signpost. We keep on following the blue. To the left by the dog statue. We've got to leave the blue trail at the dog statue. Okay. And then go off there. Tree with two trunks. To the left. Yeah, okay. We just keep on going left by the looks of it. Not here. Not there. What is that? It's a rock or a tunnel, I suppose. Through, yeah, through the tunnel to the castle. Yeah, okay. So, let's do that, shall we? This way? To be honest, I thought the castle was just going to be something that we saw in the, in the distance. I didn't think it would be something we actually get to go to. It's a really big area. A massive area, in fact. According to Leah, I should follow the blue. Precisely. See, yeah, I see another marker here. Okay, yeah. Good stuff. Okay, so. Blue and red this way. Yep, let's just keep on following the path, because right now I, I don't want to fuck this up. Uh-huh, okay, so. Yep. Here we are then. I'm going this way until what, what did it say? What did it say? Uh, document? Well, no, no. I can just I can just click this, can't I? There's map. Well, I need to I need to see a signpost to start with. So yeah, let's just keep on going till we find a start uh, a signpost. Still following the right trail. That's right. Blue and red. Uh-huh. Okay, here we go. There's the signpost, then. And what have we got here? Sculptures in sandstone. Oh, that's the thing that I missed in the first video. Oh, right. Hang on. Let's see. Yeah. That might be the dogs she was talking about. So... Yeah. I want to follow Blue this time, don't I? So let's keep on going this way. We don't cross that? No, I, I want to, but we don't do that. No, we're, we're going to stick to the path because we're following the map very well. There you go, the dogs. They look like dogs. They do. They really do. That's cool. Okay, so what do I need to do? Was it that way? Um... Something like that. Let's see. Mm, the way I went. It should be the other direction. It should be to my left, maybe. Yeah, to the left by the dog statue. Leave blue. So, oh, is there a... Aha! There you go. Ooh, I like it. So, do we go up here? Again, I, I just need to check the map. I'm going to be checking this a lot. I, I don't know how accurate this map is, really. I mean, maybe I could go that way. I don't think we're meant to, though. Let's actually stick to the path. But keep on going left when I get the chance. That's the tree with the two trunks, right? Yep, to the left. Yeah, to the left again, and, and keep left. That's it, so we just go left here. And we keep to the left, so... We go this way, we go this way. And we keep to the left, I think. Not here and not there. Maybe, yeah, maybe those were the not here and not here options. 
Well, let's go this way and let's hope we find a tunnel or something. If not, then I've probably gone the wrong way. Uh, oh, actually, if I'm getting a phone call... Oh, hey. Hi, Daniel. How's your search going? Hey, I found the girl, and... You've already found her? Uh, no, not Stella. I'm talking about a little girl I met who was sitting on the rock just below the chapel. Really? Mm. Uh, and had she seen Stella? I'm not sure. She seems shy, or maybe even secretive, as if she knows more than she'll say. I'm doing a small favor for her, and hopefully she'll open up to me. A favor? Shouldn't you find your daughter first? Mm. I just feel like it's important. If you say so. Anyway, catch you later. Stay safe. This is looking kind of promising. I know it says stay left and everything, but maybe this is what was marked on the map, this sort of tunnel thing. So, yeah. Oh, sure, yeah. Now oh, they weren't too dirty this time, but still, there you go. Refreshing. As it always is. Okay, yeah, this way. And then I just keep on following the path until I go through another tunnel, I think? I think that's how it's meant to go, anyway. Okay, I'm... I'm Ah, right. Now I know about climbing. It looks like I could climb up here. Right. But I need to get higher to reach the first hold. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so... Let's have a look at this. In there, down there, there's a golden box. Okay, I'm interested in golden boxes. And I don't have whatever I need to... to, to slot in there. To get up. Okay. Unless it's just sort of hanging around. I think we're going inside. Right. Under here. Okay. I don't like these doors. This doesn't somehow lead to the bunker, does it? Well, maybe it does. I can't actually open the door. I don't get the prompt for it. Down here. Mmm, padlocked, and it doesn't really lead to anything anyway. Okay, well, let's just go to the right then. Yeah, let's follow this, this wire, this cable, to the light that doesn't work. Oh, hang on. Uh, yeah, get down, get down. <coughs> okay, oh, no. oh, that's my way back up. Oh, is this the golden box? Could be. I Okay, we've got some magical fucking legend in there that just wants to be read before I even open the box, but it's it's about the Simbert Castle. Okay. Hey, Grizzly, this time I won. I have a legend about this very castle. There are many secret underground tunnels beneath Simbert's Castle, or Chimbert's Castle, or Kimberg's Castle. I don't know how you say that, really. But anyway, people say that a huge treasure is down there, just waiting to be discovered. Many tried to find it, but none succeeded. One day, a little boy accidentally dropped his cap into a crevice next to the castle. He climbed down to retrieve it, but got lost. After many hours of wandering, he met a strange old woman deep in the labyrinth. She showed him many beautiful caps, but he rejected them all. He insisted that he only wanted his old torn cap. The strange old woman gave him his cap, and as a present, she gave him a lantern, so he could find his way back through the tunnels. When the boy returned home, he discovered the lantern had turned into gold. Later, no matter how hard he searched, he never saw the old woman or found the entrance to the tunnels again. You can use this climbing hold as a consolation prize. Just put it back when you're done exploring. By the way, my teeth are killing me. You don't happen to have any painkillers with you. I'd appreciate them as your next treasure for me. <laughs> okay. The climbing hold. That's the thing that I maybe slot into the wall? Well, let's open the box and find out. This thing? Yeah! This might help me reach the climbing wall. And then there's some bandages by the looks of it. Yeah, okay, cool. Find out. Wait, hang on. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was skipping ahead, I suppose. I didn't actually unfold it. I was just looking at a paper aeroplane the entire time, as it turns out. Uh, yeah, sweet. So, I'm done with this, aren't I? I'm not taking that. It's not got a hidden bottom or anything. No? Okay, cool, cool. What was that? Nothing good. Nothing good. Maybe I don't want to climb up right now. The light's on, too. Okay, I can't go any further. I think it's time to go up. So, here we are. 
Shit, it's here again. Oh, shit. I, fuck, fuck, it'll hear the cell. Better hide before it finds me. Uh, Stellar as well, what the fuck did I... Oh, I, oh shit, I was sitting on one of the holes. I thought I was a bit too high. Fuck, maybe later. No, no, no. well, I mean... I didn't look who it was. I Looks figured it'd be Eleanor again. It. Time to get the hell out of here. Maybe later. Maybe Fuck later. Fuck's sake. Come on, Stella was trying to call. I mean, maybe she wasn't. Maybe you were just imagining it. But I mean... Oh, boy. Okay. I guess Leah was right. Nope. Leah could easily get through here. Ah, it's a dead end for me. Yeah, there has yeah. to be another way in. Well, that's probably the way up the cliff face, right? He's not around here? No, I think he went back into his little sort of bunker door place. Right, okay, so... Uh, that's it. Use it there. Perfect. And that's the bottom rung that we need, so we can climb... And we can take it, yes. I actually do want to take this, I suppose, later on, because I, I've seen at least one more of these things. So, yeah. Up there. Let's see, where are we going? To the right, of course we are. Uh, and to the right again, I think. Hmm. Ah, there you go. That's how I do it. Kind of. Uh, it's working anyway, let's put it that way. Can I? Oh no, no, I can't do that, I don't think. Oh, I can! Just, just! Oh my god. Uh huh. All the way to the top? All the way to the top, well done. Okay, so. Yeah, when I'm, when I'm done, when I climb down, I'll have to take that rung out and use it elsewhere. So. Are we climbing again? Oh shit, we're that close to the castle. Oh, okay. I didn't realise I was that close. Yeah, I think we must be climbing again, because I don't think there's another path. That's alright with me. Okay, so let's start here, shall we? Where's the prompt? There it is. Can you not do that one? It, it looks like you should be able to do that one, but you can't. Okay. Um... That one, lean over. There you go. It's not perfect by any means, but it does seem to be getting me to the top. Sure, okay. Uh, there's some bugs. <laughs> I'm alright with it though. I'm alright with it. I made it. Cool. Really? Cool. I suppose Leah's over there somewhere. Like maybe that rock? I can barely see it, to be honest. Um, can I actually just... Okay, this doesn't seem safe. Probably because it's not. Oh, but look, there's a lurk there. If nothing else, there is a lurk and some bottles. I think that's number eight. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, I can just explore down there, can't I? I really do like the map in this. Anyway, yeah. Uh, let's see. What is that over there? Ah, I looked out of place. Ah. Huh. They're arranged to look like there's no way through. But there is, isn't there? Hopefully that doesn't ruin the structural integrity of the entire fucking castle. I'll be going through there in a moment. I just want to make sure that there's nothing else. There's no way I could jump over that. Oh, come on, you pessimist. No, you can't. I mean, there's no there's no real jumping in this game, so no, you, you definitely can't. Through here then, go on. Okay, so the doll. It's in Burke Castle, right. We're we going to find a QR code somewhere around here. Maybe this is a, a real place that we, uh, we might be able to learn about, you know? Okay, have I still got the... Yeah, I've, I've still got the Flower Sense Potion. I don't think that runs out. I think maybe it used to, but the developers changed it so that you only had to make it and use it once. I've got to break through this. And that side as well, by the looks of it. Got to break through this. Got to find something to use to break through it. What am I going to find? And is it up there? 
Another blocked path. Yeah. <laughs> Must be my karma. Yes. Let's talk about karma. Ooh, actually, forget about karma. Let's talk about sledgehammers, because I just found one. Okay, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Mm, don't want to fall down. Let's go this way. Ah! Ooh. What was that? That looked so strange. Did I just... What? Oh, Matt, that's what it was? They're attacking me? Oh my goodness. Oh, and they're not letting me leave either. Weird. Weird. It's it's cool, but it's so weird. There's probably a reason for it. Anyway, let's get through this. Okay. Easy enough. Get down. Yep. And what are we going to find next? There's another drawing over there. And what looks to be another licorice. Wait. No. Huh. No back. Ugh. Okay. Let's take a look. Don't really want Henbane, do I? I? Incredible. They've been trying to fix this place for more than 20 years. I bet that in a different reality they'd have finished the repairs ages ago. Alright, there's a there's a workbench. Oh I see, right, yeah. Let's open the locker and we find hang on. Oh. There's a key. Let's hope that this is the key to the front gate. Right, yeah, we're gonna need a way out of this place, I suppose. That's it? That's all we find? I think so. Mm, apparently I can use them. I don't know if that's wise. Shit. Shit. Yep. I can't get out until these things are gone. Well, let's get rid of these things then, shall we? Alright, so up and around. Okay. Damn. Ooh. The vertigo's back. Shit. Maybe the potion can help me again. Oh, is that is that a ladder over there? Yeah, maybe that's why I've been seeing all these herbs, actually. So I can make the Calm Mind potion again. Uh, so, H. Uh, let's see. Calm Mind, that's right. So, crush that, add it to the mix. Boom, there you go, another potion. Calm Mind. Huh. I was hoping that was going to last a little bit longer than it did. But, okay. Doesn't seem like it's a terribly long way down, really, but sure. Uh, so... Glug, glug, glug. Okay, how you feeling? Pretty good. What the fuck's this thing? Is that a crow trying to fly away from it? It's, what the... This totem, or whatever it is, makes my head spin. Right. Okay, well, don't look at it, then. Gee, throw it down. <laughs> Oh, the poor bird! It That's just bullshit. Yeah. I don't believe these things are causing my dizziness. Careful. Oh. This one could crack. Oh shit, that gave me such a jump! Okay. I, e oh Christ, just going into that mode as well. Is this one gonna... I don't think this one's gonna crack. So that's how we get across. And then I guess we get across to the ladder if we can't go through there. But hang on. Yeah. Yeah, I guess falling down here isn't the worst. It's not that big a fall. Oh god. I don't know what I'm getting myself into really. But let's go this way. I really am enjoying this game. When I know what I'm doing and when I'm exploring, that's fucking frightening. Seeing the door open. Uh yeah, it's it's actually pretty damn good. Oh, maybe this is our way out. Hey! Oh, okay. Uh, let's get some more ingredients because we might be using Calm Mind again. Yeah, more bachelor buttons as well. That's right. And another look. Hey, there you go. I think that's number nine. Licorice, yes. Uh, can I get another one? Yes, I can. Okay, so we're outside the castle walls. Again, though, it, maybe not the safest way down. So, yeah, maybe. We're still hoping <laughs> that the key is for the gate. I don't know if I want to go this way. 
Did I really fuck up by declining that call from Stella? It just felt like I needed to get rid of the phone immediately, and I couldn't climb down if the phone was ringing. Okay, again, I, I can't get through there, but I can go this way. <laughs> ah, sh I can slip this way. Bugger. Something down here? Are they, like... Oh, I think someone's trying to crawl out of there. Oh, God, what's... What's that? <laughs> Don't want to go through there. Or through there, really. Might want to go through there, actually. Yeah, almost certainly. I think... Yeah, there's a hole. Okay, prison escape. Here we go. This way? Karma, uh, 26 minutes. Hopefully I, I don't waste those 26 minutes just lurking around here and not using it properly, but still, I'm curious. Okay. What the fuck's that? What, are they like roots? Or cables? Or... What? Wow. All right. This is pretty incredible looking. Yeah, don't get too close, of course. That's mental. Really, that's that's actually mental. So what do we got here? A caged bird? Hmm. I don't suppose I can really do anything about it. In fact, I probably should stay away from interacting with birds, because I'll probably just throw you to the ground like I did the other one. Something down here? Oh, man. Let's hope this holds up. Okay, well, there's something in the box. Uh, yep. Is it another legend or something? I should check out who lost back then. It oh. could help me discover what's going on here. It's a quest. Alright, well that, again, didn't seem to do too much, but let's read. The most dangerous of the forest creatures are the Mura. They are white, female spectres who intercept human settlements in the form of a vegetable stalk, pale shadow, or a white cat. Some even transform into flies with a red band around their tiny necks. Mura usually suffocate sleeping people, but they also harm animals, plants, and trees. Not everyone knows that the Mura is a living human, who only turns into a demonic form at night without actually knowing it. You can repel them with the gift of a fresh bread or a sign called Mura's Leg, as depicted below. I found one of these devil spawns on my way from our settlement as I walked toward the St. Clement's Chapel. A large totem of a horned animal talked to me and asked me to take the left path. There, hidden in a dark forest, was a huge Mura lying in wait for me. I fought her and obtained a symbol of knowledge. In her last minute, she already tainted many trees by various symbols to lead me astray, but I persisted and used my newly found knowledge to locate the proper symbol which opened the path for me. K. That's it. That's, that's the only thing in there. Well, that sounds quite interesting, honestly. Um... Can I get... Okay, I can get around this, I think. Let's go up here. Oh, oh, this is the door! Uh, yeah, that's probably a, a good shout. No jump scare? Not this time. <laughs> Alright, let's open it up. I think we're safe. Okay. Is that... Okay, that's where I slipped, so this is just our way down now. So where did the other path go? There was another tunnel, right? I think I could have gone down there, too. How much time have I got left? 24 minutes of calm mind. Yeah, it's not really calming my mind right now. What in the hell is this? We got some supplies. Or at least some old cans. Some old tins. What's oh, is that... A, that's, a, that's another guitar song. Of all the fucking places. Is this... This is where the beast eats. It's his little dining room. Ew. Oh. Is that a cap? A bloodied cap? Goodness, this is so weird. Can't climb it? No, I can't climb it. Okay, well, I want to get out of here because it's a dead end and I think this is where the beast probably lurks. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Uh, well, I can't go that way because it's too slippy, but yes, that way I should be able to get up. Back to the right. Um, and to the right again. No, not the right again. This way. Crawl through here. That's it, yeah. That's it. 
<laughs> Back to walking across the planks. That's what I was doing. <laughs> Good stuff. Nothing else to find? Right, yeah. That, that plank cannot be trusted. These two? These two, a little bit better. Okay, can't actually get through there, but that's okay. I should be able to go up and around. Ooh. Here we go. Here we go. Still looking out for a doll. Not this shit. Oh my god. It's like this whole place is infected. That... Does, no, no, that still doesn't... That still doesn't work. Even with Calm Mind. Is there a, another... Hang on. Oh, yeah. Oh, look, there's another one of those things. You can see it. It's got some sort of dark energy that's, like, feeding that thing. Let's see if we can get rid of it. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry, little blackbird crow thing. I don't know what you are, but you're gone. So, it's true. What the hell am I dealing with? Can we just drop down there? Feels like I should be able to. Oh, I was ready for it as well, but no, I, I didn't. Let's go down. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, let's hope that this plank doesn't split in the middle. Ooh! I actually got a bit of a sort of running head start with that one, and it seemed to work. Look at this. Looks like I've just stepped into someone's playground. Is that a body up there? That isn't a body up there, is it? Maybe that's the doll. <laughs> right. Uh, down here, then. Looks like the safest way. Is that... A no, that's not a ladder. Down. Uh, calm down. Calm down. No, don't. Don't fall. <coughs> just drop. That's it. And again, yeah, let's do this right. Okay. Hold on. Oh, move. Oh. Oh, right! Hey, oh, uh, so where are we moving this to? Is there another platform that we need to get onto? Look at all these. This is quite grotesque, actually. It's cool, though. It's really cool. Anyway, with that out of the way... What about this? Ah, yeah, can I... Yeah, can we push this? Pull it? That'll do it. That'll do. This is the workbench. Uh, alright. Got some nails there. Get a good grip. Still, yeah, I still got the tools. I haven't thrown these away yet, and hopefully I never do. Uh, maybe these? Yep! Okay, um, this side? Yep. Physics! Alright, so that's a, an easier way back. So this thing does have to move. Where does it have to move to? Over there? Probably, right? Yeah, licorice. Devil's eyelashes. Yeah, I don't want to get too close. don't want to get bitch slapped by those fucking hands. What? Okay, now I'm curious about the bags. Okay, that's... I mean, that's that's ideal, isn't it? Really? Unless... Well, no, not really, because I can't... <laughs> I can't get to the ladder to begin with, but that'll do. That'll do it. Okay, so... Yeah, what's going on here? Can't do it with my bare hands. Okay, well, cut it open. What's this? Why would the beast keep the doll parts separated like that? I'd better keep it. Right. Yeah, I'd better keep it. So hang on, the, the doll... Are we going to find more doll parts in the other sacks as well? Okay. Uh, well, yeah, it, I think that's probably the case. <coughs> so maybe we're not actually going over there. Or, or not yet. That's not for the doll. Let's go to that one next, I suppose. So let's pull this back. Okay, so again, let's just knife this open, I suppose. Another one? 
Okay, so uh, we've got a couple of legs. We're going to need to find a couple of arms, a torso, and a head, I suppose. That's what we're going to find in the other sacks. <sighs> this is all going to be worth it, right? I mean, I am going to find out about Stella. Okay, okay, is that... Okay, it's the arm and the hand. I was wondering if that was just the hand. Here we are, another one, and again, the knife comes out. This is going to be another... Oh, it's a lurk? Oh. oh even here. Even here, apparently. Okay. Uh, well, I'm going to find a, an arm somewhere, and the torso and a head somewhere else. That one over there? The one back there? It's, it's got to be one of those two, right? And, well, yeah, okay. There we go. Cut it open. Oh, a deer's head? And that's it. Okay, so it's not that one. It's got to be that one over there. Can I reach across? No. God damn. Okay. So if I don't find what I need to in here, we're going to have to go exploring that way, I think. So. It's knife time. Hey, there we go. Okay, so I found the limbs. We're just missing a torso and a head. So I guess I'm going to find the torso and the head somewhere else. Just just not here, basically. Okay, so just drop onto this. Do not break. Okay, we've made it. And we've saved. That's good. I've still got, I've still got Calm Mind. I've got 12 minutes of Calm Mind. I'm probably going to need it as I uh, ascend another wall. Um, tell you what, let's maybe get my left hand over there, and then go over there. I'm gonna need to go all the way over there, aren't I? So if I put my hand there... That's a bit of a bugger, actually. That... Oh no, I, I, I can just about grab it! And I can grab that, do that. Same thing. Yep. And we're going up. And we keep on going up. That's it. To the left. Yep. Switch over. Over there. If I put my hand there and then I put the hand there. That doesn't really work. Can I reach all the way across? Yep, that works. Nice. Beautiful. Even just climbing up the walls is like a, a bit of a puzzle. And I'm quite liking them, really. Oh my god, Come okay. On, you've got to be kidding me. Absolutely. So there's another one over there. Can oh, oh, there's a bit of a gap. I didn't realize there was a gap. Okay. Calm mind. Ten minutes of calm mind. I don't really think I should make another potion while I'm doing this. Maybe I should make another one just in case it runs out. Let's throw this one down. I'm just so cruel to the birds. Should probably untie them, but whatever. Over here. Okay, yep. Kind of want to go that way, but I probably don't because of uh, that strange aberration in front of me. Let's get rid of this. Seriously, don't fall. This is this is a long drop. Of yeah, I probably shouldn't look down either. Over here. Yep. Yes, sirree, we're doing it. Mm-hmm. Get down like a clown, Charlie Brown. Okay, yeah, ten minutes of calm mind. Lots of planks. That's gonna snap, isn't it? Yes, okay, yeah, I saw that one coming and I still tempted fate. This one? No, not this one. Okay, this nah, not that one either. We're going all the way around here. <laughs> uh, this one. Oh sh! Oh, I was I was ready to commit to that one. I was so certain that was going to be it. This one. No. Okay. Right. This is going to be a painful trip back, isn't it? This one. Yeah. Oh, which one was that? Oh, it was that one. Okay, I don't need to go on that one. Oh, there's a lurk down there. I didn't realize there was a lurk down there. Over here? Yep. The devil's eyelashes, I see. Can we... Yes, we're still... 
We're still balancing over. Yeah, let's pick some bachelor buttons. This is the perfect time. Okay. Ah, okay, so that's feeding that one. I need to go all the way across. This one's gonna break. No, it's not. Okay, I'm shocked. This one? This way. Maybe that plank would have broke. Okay, right, yes. Let's get rid of that. Immediately. Throw that down, holy shit. Okay. Keep on going. Wait, that is a body up there, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, we haven't got too long to go. Grab it. There we go. Throw it down. So that's got rid of that. That's fantastic. Let's go across. That's that's half broken already. We're going to have to go the long way around, but that's okay because I've got... Yeah, I've got eight more minutes of calm mind. Let me just test. Yep. Okay. <laughs> and this one. This one looks strong. This one looks... Oh, these ones. These beams. Yeah, they're very strong. And we're up. Okay. Maybe the doll actually is up there. I, I kind of hope it is at this point. Gotta go this way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's it. Ooh. Throw it down. Beautiful. Okay. Can I go straight across to this? Yes. Yeah, I don't want to step on that plank, though, of course. Christ, I couldn't find the prompt for that one. So that's moved out of the way. <laughs> that's a long way down. Okay. This doll is not worth it. It really isn't. I mean, I've got the legs. I've got the arms. Maybe I could just construct the body and the head out of herbs. Because I've got quite a lot of those. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Is that... Get... Mm, I don't really want to get down. I mean, not yet. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's the missing... That's the missing piece. Or missing pieces. The torso and the head together. Looks harmless to me. Huh. Mia won't be happy if I give it to her like this. He's definitely a dad. Because that was certainly a dad joke. A decrypted page. Uh, yes. This is the perfect time to read. Okay, so hopefully you've gone through this in your own time from the last video. I'm just going to read the new page here, okay? So, 12th of July, four more days. I ran away from camp and up here so I didn't have to be around anyone. Dad doesn't believe anything I try to tell him. He is... Never. Never around when I need him. He is always away with... Eleonora. Crossed out. Nina. Oscar and his friends gang up on me and when Dad comes back, everyone acts like nothing happened. I really hate them. But they won't see me crying no matter how hard they punch me. From now on, I'll just run away. Wish I was back home. I'm never coming to this stupid camp again. I would rather die. <sighs> oh dear. Eleonora, though. Interesting. Okay. Uh, is this also the perfect time for me to, you know, put this back together? Yeah. That's right. Can I put the arm... Okay, hang on. Maybe I could put, like, an arm down there. <gasps> I can't! Amazing. I'm like Idi Amin or something. Um, perfect. Yes. It's horrific. It's amazingly horrific. I'm going to maybe do this properly, though. So the leg goes there. Yep. There was a way down here? Yeah. Three minutes of calm mind. I need to get down pretty quick, actually. Okay. Oh, God. Yeah, get down. Another heart needs to be stabbed. Drop. Oh, we're going to drop the plank like it's hot. Okay. That's a little shortcut down. Right, let's stab this first, though. Yeah, pierce that. Here it is. It must be the one blocking my way out. So if I get rid of this, I get rid of the hands. And then I could maybe get to the gate. Okay. Good 
Good stuff. So that's taken care of. Let's go across here. Come on, think calm. That's it, get down. So I don't have to go through all that shit again. That's good, that's good. So... Fast, yeah, fa <laughs> really, really quickly, let's climb down. Well done. Um, over here, drop down, drop down again. Okay, so these, yeah, these have died as well? That's right, okay, so the, they were blocking me from... I don't know, a hole? Oh, a lurk! Okay, we got a lurk! Hey! I, oh, careful. <laughs> Alright, I think we're in the double digits with those now. That's it. Hang on, can I climb up here? Oh, just about. Oh, that's the lurk that I saw from up there. Right, so can I just maybe sidle around the wall here? I don't know. Yes. Yes, I can. And there's another one. Very nice. Yeah, I think I've got like 11 or 12 of those now. Cool. I, uh, I don't know, maybe in this game finding more collectibles, maybe it gives you a better ending. Maybe it increases your karma in some way, because, I don't know, I'm just clearing up. You know, I'm <laughs> I hate littering that much. These guys, they're dead too? Yes. Right, so this door. Yeah, okay, I've got the key for it. Yeah, that's it. We're out. Oh, hang on. A sign? No, it's a QR code. There you go, for the castle. So now you can learn a little bit more about it. Sweet. Okay. Uh, I don't think I need a mandrake. No, no, we're pretty much full of everything. I'm pretty sure. Let's see, though. Yeah, let's learn about the castle. Nice. Yeah, even the signs are, are collectibles in this game. Pretty much everything is a collectible. Cool. That was fun. That was somewhat unexpected as well. I, I really didn't think I'd be able to explore the castle. It just looked too far away. It looked like it was part of the skybox, you know? Uh, so... I got another message. Okay. Could you give me a call when you have a... Yes, yes, I can. There's something I need to ask you. Ask away. You told me that Stella might be at the camp. Well, I thought I could find proof of that, but then someone tried to burn me alive. Mm. The only thing I had a chance to grab was the diary. I know this sounds strange, but is it possible you were at the wrong camp? What do you mean? I'm not sure, but could there be a second camp out here? No. This is the only camp in the area. At least the only one I know of. Anyway, she's been there several times before. So it would make sense she'd go back there to hide. Hmm. That's strange. I just forget that I said anything. But you must have some reason for asking. Did you find something there? Uh, it's probably nothing. I'll talk <laughs> to you later. Probably. Wait, I... Strange. Okay. Well, uh... I, I suppose I want to go back to the monastery now. I, I, I've got the doll. I've got all the parts of the doll. We just need to get out of here. So, yeah, let's go... Could we go all this way? Maybe we could go all the way south and then all the way northwest. Back up to Lucky Leaf. Maybe that's a thing. Cool. Yeah, I mean, maybe. Still, though, yeah, let's go northwest to Little Rock and then down. Uh, back to the dogs and stuff, I suppose, if possible. Oh, of course, I, I want to. I want to go back and I want to get that that rung that I stuck into the wall so I could climb. So yeah, I definitely want to go back, don't I? But there it is. It's still there. It hasn't been yanked away. I don't want to climb. I want to take it. Good stuff. Okay. Through here. E oh, oh, okay. I guess we're loading another part of the forest. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. I can see the pole. So, she should be on the rock or by the campfire. She's grown a bit. Damn it. Where is that girl? Oh, great. It's the droning hag. From the opening. But maybe she can help me find Leah. Unless she ate her. <laughs> I don't think she ate her, or at least I hope not. Uh, excuse me. Uh, I'm looking for a little girl wearing a uniform... Red scarf. She was supposed to wait here for me. You didn't happen to see her. No, I haven't seen Stella. 
Her name is... What did you just say? Yeah. I haven't said anything yet, young man. Why is she lying? I'm gonna push back. When I first got here, you chanted some some weird rhyme about falling down. That's right. Or is, is that just another thing you didn't say? Okay, whatever. Just tell me if you saw Leah, the girl I asked about before. I saw her many times. Running around here, there. Little precious bird, caught in a cage. I haven't seen her today, at least not yet. It was a long way down, wasn't it? Stop lying to me, mm. and just tell me what you know. What the hell is going on Why in this damn forest? are you shouting at me, young man? I'm sorry. I hear whispering and, and damn voices. My brain feels so messed up. You don't hear any voices, do you? I might be old, but you also think I'm deaf. <laughs> One thing you can tell. They really are mad at you. Who they? Are they? This forest is ancient, and he has a long memory. Once people knew how to listen and learn from it. Now you only hear yourself, your phones, and your own silly problems. You don't care about the land anymore, but it remembers you. I've been here many times in the past. I never heard these whispers before. Because you didn't want to hear them. You said you're looking for a girl, didn't you? Two of them. You have anything closely connected to her? I have her doll, which I was supposed to bring back. That won't do. She didn't give it to you. Mm. I'm also looking for my daughter. That must be the reason why I came here. Years ago, she gave me this amulet as a present. Right. Ah, that's all you need. Now listen to what the voices have to say. It's just gibberish. I, it makes no sense. You are hopeless. Thanks. Maybe you just need to clear your mind. There's an old recipe that can help. It's called True Sight. That's a new one. Cook crushed mandrake root, okay. then throw in two old psilocybin mushrooms, crush two leaves of nightshade and add them to the mix. Okay. Finally, add single crushed devil's trumpet root. Drink a cup of this potion. And you will see where the land holds a memory. Oh, mm. shit. She's a total nutcase, a witch, or both. Both. How can I believe any... I don't think that you have any choice. If you want to find who you seek. And I certainly yeah. do want to find her. Leave me alone, young man. I need to rest. Yeah. Just come back when you manage to make the potion. I want to see if you survive drinking it. Me too, actually. Me too. I'm kind of interested. Why do I think she's like a grown-up version of Leah? Okay, so let me just let me just make sure there's no trace of her. I can see. I can see. I think I saw the box of pencils up there. I can't climb up there myself, can I? No. Um, buckhorn. Yeah. I. You know what? I think I've got everything I need for this for this potion. So. Well, I mean, that's that's the next move, isn't it? True sight, here we go. So one mandrake. It's crushed mandrake root. There you go. Two whole mushrooms. Just straight in. Okay. Two henbane leaves. Okay, I've got a I've got a couple of those. Gotta crush them first. Finally, I had crushed devil's trumpet root. So, that's the one. Let's crush it up. Put it in. We've got true sight. Okay. Yeah. Let's see, shall we? Is there a prompt? I've got it. Or shall I just take it? Maybe I should just take it. Fuck it, let's just take it. Here we go, true sight. Okay. I can hear more whispering. Okay, what's going on here? Thing. This all happened the second oh. time I was there. Five? No, it must have been four years ago. That voice. That's some crazy shit. I recognize it. And there was a fire? You bet. And the worst part was that for years I thought it was my fault. You were only what? Nine years old? And where was he when this happened? Mercy. Yeah, I don't know. He never told me. It didn't end well. Stella? Maybe. Right. And there's some footprints as well leading in this sort of direction. Oh, there's some more. 
Okay. Oh, oh, okay. I tried to stop them, but they were too strong. They just punched me in the face, and when I fell on the ground, they kept kicking me, so I stayed there. Fucking assholes. So what happened next? They continued with their damn Inquisition crap, <laughs> threatened to burn the other kids in the bonfire. I was so scared, Alex. So she was here. But what really happened? I hope the memory doesn't stop here. I need to know the truth. Okay, calm down. Calm Maybe I should be drinking Calm Mind alongside this because I'm, I'm getting too many thoughts at once. Yeah, yeah, alright, so... Let's just keep on following the footsteps. Where's, where are they going to take me? Hopefully not back to the castle because I just came from there. That would be kind of annoying. Okay, I suppose I really want to look out for, you know, other things as well, because I did use quite a few herbs. And they ran away when the fire started? Yeah. I tried to put it out using an old kitchen pot, <laughs> which was completely stupid. But then he came back and saved the camp from the worst of the fire. Did you ever tell him what really happened? He never listened to me. Later, the kids told him I started the fire. Hmm. Let's keep it going. Buckhorn, don't need that. Don't need silverweed or the buttons or anything. I would need some devil's trumpet. I would need some salicide mushrooms and stuff like that, though. He had to leave the next day. He was so angry that he completely stopped talking to me. Did you ever get a chance to tell him the truth? No. And I don't care. He never explained why he wasn't there either. The only thing he really cares about is himself. <sighs> Shit. This makes me angry. <laughs> Let it go. It was a long time ago. I'm glad I met you. That's all that matters now. Hmm, okay. Keep on learning more and more. There's more of these footprints though, so I guess there's going to be more that I learn. True Sight, it, it, I, it doesn't actually have like a, a countdown or whatever. It doesn't have a timer in the top left, so honestly I don't know how long I'm going to have this for. No, okay, so... Uh-huh, down here. To the bridge? Yeah, right. I love this place. The water always calms me down. Further down, there's a much bigger bridge. Want to go there? I don't think sure. there is anymore. Let's go. Yeah, <laughs> I think I tried to cross it and it just didn't exist. I suppose maybe she was talking about something else. I think she went this way? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, it looks like they went this way. There you go. What's wrong? Can we wait here for a while? You're so pale. Maybe we should go back. It's nothing. Let's sit down on this rock. I'll be fine in a minute. Let's go. Are you sure you don't want to go back? I'm fine. Let's race down the hill. The last one to the bridge is a rotten egg. Wait! <laughs> Alexander, don't worry. The last one to the bridge is going to be me. By uh, a considerable amount. Oh, up here. Mm, all right. Just straight across, yep. Down there, yeah. Who needs to follow the trails, right? Oh, I was just... I was about to uh, lose my way then. We're going this way. Following the trail, or... Yep, looks like it. Okay, let's check this area out. It's a big old campfire, or it used to be. There's like a fenced off area there as well. Oh shit, look, there's a there's a drawing. How do we get through this? I can't actually use the handle. Maybe there's a way I, I guess I could I could just drop down potentially. Unlock this from the other side. Let's do this maybe later on, though. Let's keep on following this. I don't know how long this True Sight potion is going to last. Hopefully long enough. Oh, oh, maybe this is the bridge she was talking about. It seems to me that the potion led me here on purpose. Mm. Leah must be linked to all this. But how? Well, let's listen. I love how rivers flow so fast. I sometimes think, what would happen if I just jumped in? Where would this one take me? You would drown. <laughs> Do you think it goes all the way to the sea? I've never been to the sea. One day I'm going to take you. Damn, the memories faded away. Oh, but we do have another decrypted page by the looks of it. 
Okay, so we're moving on to the 16th of July now. Yesterday was so wonderful. I didn't have time to write, but I spent almost the whole day with Alexander. We saw the stone labyrinth and it's amazing. It's full of beautiful rocks and weird twisty little passages. I love that place. When we reached the heart of the labyrinth, Alex, Alex asked me about the Lucky Leaf Fire. At first, I wanted to run away, but then something about that place was so insanely cool. We sat down under a huge tree and I told him what happened. The real story. I don't know what he thought, but at least someone finally listened to me, and if he doesn't believe me, then screw him. I'm proud of myself for hiding how hard it was for me to walk. He didn't have a clue. The pain is terrible and comes almost every day. Oh, damn, the more I read, the more I feel sorry for her. Tracks? Yeah. Okay, so... Nothing over here? No? Well, there's a, there's a bit of a gap there, but... Nothing up there either? No, okay. Just wanted to make sure. Just wanted to make sure. Tracks again? Yeah, let's examine it. Definitely went this way. Hmm. Okay. Definitely the potential to get lost in pretty much all of the forest. Let's go this way. I'm kind of curious about that drawing. Yeah, yeah, and uh, I'm finding more tracks, so this is it. I'm just going to keep my eyes to the ground, essentially. Uh, oh, I got another message. Okay, who is it? Eleonora? Yes. Uh, how are you holding up? Oh, okay. Um... I can ignore it. Uh, I I don't feel like giving up, but still nothing. I'm, I'm getting desperate. She's writing something. This is kind of neat, this system. Hang in there, Dan. I might be onto something. I'll call you soon. I'm just going to ignore that. I think I'd probably type back something like, okay, speak to you soon. But that's just me. Right. Here we go, we got the tracks. They seem to be veering off to the left towards yet another sort of chalk drawing, so... Ah, is that the doll that I've got by any chance? Here we are. Kind of hard to see in the shadow, but... Yeah, they do go up there, the... Squirrel cat thing. <laughs> okay. Right. This way? We're going this way then. The, oh. Maybe this is Eleonora. It is, yes. Hey Dan. Anything new in your end? Yeah, I found that doll for Leah. Who's Leah? The little girl I told you about. I'm absolutely sure she knows something about Stella. How so? Well, she forced me to go to this this place. It seemed to be connected to my past. I, I just can't remember how. So I brought her the doll, and then she ran off and vanished. <laughs> well, maybe she just went home. Mm. With all the dark stories about these woods, little girls are not usually allowed to be here alone. I don't think she has an actual home. Well, anyway, I called you because I need to know something. Go on. Sure. What is it? Was there someone called Alexander at one of your camps? Mm. Well, uh, over the years, there were a lot of kids. No, I don't mean any kid. He would be someone special to you, or Stella, maybe to both of you. Now that I think about it, the name seems familiar, but I'm damned if I can remember why. Come on, try to remember. Damn it. I feel like my memory's going to hell. Because it I is. I should remember all these things. Mm. Okay, so if you manage to remember anything, let me know. It could be very important. Will do. And how, how are you holding up? I feel guilty that you're spending so much time helping me. I'll be gone when I need to. Anyway, this is very intriguing. Thank you, Elle. It is. You have no idea how much I appreciate this. Don't worry about it. There is something in it for me as well. Oh? What? <laughs> me, maybe. I'm not really sure. Anyway, yeah, I, I was sort of half following the tracks. I think we're going in the right direction. We keep on seeing these drawings. So, it's, it's got to be a good thing, right? 
I, I, it's strange you can't remember you know, Alexander, considering that he was just hearing him and reading about him and everything, but whatever. Wow, look at this tree. Holy shit. Oh. Uh, Tibor's Oak, Tibor's Oak, maybe? Cool. All right. Oh. It's been infected. Just like the castle. Oh, shit. Okay, well, let's learn about it. 500 years old. <laughs> According to local legend, there are supernatural forces at play. Yeah, I think you're probably right. I'm kind of looking for a QR code. I don't know if the you know one exists here's for this. Our little refugee. Oh, hey, that it is. It's Leah. Is this how you keep your promise? I'm running around doing you favors like a complete idiot. And you can't even wait for me a, a few damn minutes in a safe place. You know what? Keep your stupid doll. I'm done with you. Leah, please come back. I'm, I'm sorry I yelled at you. I, hmm. I was just so afraid the beast got you. Oh, shit. I have to catch her before she gets hurt. Oh, boy. Okay, all right. Leah. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, where did she go? There's so many places she could have possibly... Leah, oh, right. Wait. Come on, please, seriously, wait. This way? Oh my god, there's so many nooks and crannies. This is, oh my god, here? This, yeah, yeah, I see her, I see her. It's like a labyrinth, this place. Slow down! And that's, that's what Stella said, right? It was a labyrinth. Yep, there you are. Underneath that, okay. Uh, not okay, no, I'm too tall for that. Now she's getting away again. This way? She must have gone this way. Disappear to? Yeah. Around here? Can we, uh, yeah. Mm. This is reminding me of the, the woman that ran into the spider cave. You know, like through the cobwebs and the barbed wire and there was no trace of her. Okay. Let's assume that she did all this. Okay, that's quite a long way down. There's some water down there this time, not planks, but let's... Yep, there we go. Stay on two feet. What the fuck? A cave, another cave. Yeah, oh my god, yeah, it's getting dark. Yes, down here. Uh, oh. We were just loading the cave. And we're still loading the cave, and the FPS is back, and we've loaded the cave. <laughs> uh, no, we haven't. Yes, we have. A little bit alarming, don't you think? Anyway, uh, I hope I'm going the right way. It's got awfully dark again, awfully quickly. It does tend to do that in this forest. Right. Oh boy, all oh, the clearing. Oh. Doesn't look too fucking clear to me. There's another one of those hearts. Goodness gracious me. Leah? Stella? <laughs> Eleonora? Wow. Oh. Is that I her? I need to get to her and fast. Uh, oh, is that. It's the hag. Is she behind all this? Maybe. Oh, look. Oh, it's the children, the fog children. She's a witch! She's a witch! A pretty good one. What is that thing? Oh, shit! Oh, god. Oh, she's gone. She's... The witch is dead. <laughs> got her. Maybe she actually came to help Leah. Yeah, maybe. They're still suspended in the air, though. Those spider thing? Oh, no, no, no. Okay. It, it's worn off. Those spider things, though, they're still crawling around. Right, yes, Leah. i got to help you. But I've been playing for a long time, so I'm going to help you next time. Thank you very much for watching part five of Someday You'll Return. I hope to see you back in part six, where we'll go down there into the clearing that isn't clear. We'll avoid all the trials and tribulations, the monsters, and any further witches, and we'll see if we can get to Leah and rescue her. See you next time. 
There are some things that just don't make sense. Tell me about it. What? Maybe you can. Oh, oh, it's working. Oh. Oh! What? I just fucking throw it away. What if the wind took that away? So, oh, is there a... Ha ha! There you go. Oh, I like it. Oh, is this the golden box? Could be. I... Okay, we've got some magical fucking legend in there. What was that? Nothing good. That was stellar as well. What the fuck the... Can I? Oh no, no, I can't do that. I don't think. Oh, I can. Just, just. Oh my god. But it does seem to be getting me to the top. Sure. Okay. Don't want to fall down. Let's go this way. Ah, oh. Throw it down. Oh, the poor bird. These things are causing my dizziness. Careful. Oh. This one could crack. Oh shit, that gave me such a jump! I really am enjoying this game. When I know what I'm doing and when I'm exploring, that's fucking frightening. How much time I got left? 24 minutes of calm mind. Yeah, it's not really calming my mind right now. This is gonna be another... Oh, it's a lurk? Oh. oh even here. Even here, apparently. Okay. <laughs> Lots of planks. That's gonna snap, isn't it? Yes! Yeah, let's pick some bachelor buttons. This is the perfect time. The torso and the head, together. Looks armless to me. Huh. Yeah, Can I put the arm... Okay, hang on. Maybe I could put, like, an arm down there. Oh, I can! Through here. E oh, oh, okay. I guess we're loading another part of the forest. Okay. <laughs> she should be on the rock. Or by the campfire. She's grown a bit. Throw in two old psilocybin mushrooms. Crush two was here. But what really happened? I hope the memory doesn't stop here. I need to know the truth. Okay, calm down. Calm Maybe I should be drinking Calm Mind alongside this because I'm, I'm getting too many thoughts at once. The last one to the bridge is a rotten egg. Wait! <sighs> Alexander, don't worry. The last one to the bridge is going to be me. Wow, look at this tree. Holy shit. <laughs> uh. Oh. She's a witch! She's a witch! 